Lorient welcomed Nantes here to study Yves Alamain on Saturday evening, hoping to build on a good start to the season. Veteran Ludovic Julie made it into Christophe Gourcuff's starting 11 for the first time. Nancy, who were beaten by Toulouse this week, had been given clear instructions by coach Jean Fernandez keep hold of the ball. It didn't take long for Lorient's early pressure to pay dividends. Jordan Lotiès completely mishit his attempted back pass to his keeper, and Julie took advantage to put the hosts 1 0 up. A furious Jacques Rousselot, the Nancy president, could hardly believe his eyes after this terrible defensive error. It was Julie's 85th League One goal and leaves him only one behind Peggy Liendula, the most prolific goal scorer still in action. Into the 33rd minute and Lucas Morek threaded the ball through to Jan Jouf, who was hauled down in the area by Salif Sani. A penalty logically awarded by Monsieur Gauthier. Sané lunging in from behind and failing to get anywhere near the ball. Alan Traore stepped up but saw his effort rebound off the post. Lorient's second goal was not long in coming, however. Traore made up for his penalty miss when his 35th minute corner was headed in by Lamine Kone and the hosts doubled their lead. The replay suggests that the ball may have been helped on its way by Nancy captain Sébastien Puigrenier. Nancy attempted to hit back, and just before half-time won a free kick 25 yards out. Roman Grange's excellent strike was wonderfully saved by Fabiano Dal. 2-0 at half-time then, with the hosts in cruise control. Jacques Rousselot's expression sang it all. Into the second half, with Nancy coach bringing on Thomas Manginini for Jeff Louis. Nancy had another chance early in the half. Lossamy Caraboué cut in from the right and played a neat one-two with Grange before finding Jamel Bakar. Ordar with a comfortable save. If Traore had made up for his penalty miss with an assist for the second goal, he put himself back in credit with this phenomenal free kick five minutes from time. A wonderful strike from the Burkina Bay striker that Undi Asembe could do precious little about. 3-0 at full time then and a very convincing performance from Lorient who climbed to third on Saturday night. <laughs> 